Hey everyone, it's Ryanstorm82 here with, uh, I think this is my third Creature Stuff Scenario video. Uh, but today I'm not going to be doing like, oh, I'm going to survive as this creature. Now I'm going to teach you how to, you know, get some more mushrooms. Oh, I fell off. Uh, but before we get started, make sure to, oops, to smash the social like buttons and share this video. Now let's get to it. Oh, look at that, I grew. Alright. So first off, I'm going to head back to the menu so that I can get, like, a, a speedy creature. Like, one that can actually fly instead of just this. Alright, now, look, two seconds, right? ba ba da Pew! Let me get rid of that. And then you're going to want to get something like the Bree Quick, so that you can be kind of fast. So it's this one. It's one of the starter creatures. Either you get this one or... Where is it? Uh, or you can get this one, the Sochuri. Uh, it, it's not loading in. But, yeah, I would prefer the Bree Quick so that you can get some more mushrooms. And I have a lot of mushrooms, but I sold, like, everything that I have. So, yeah. Alright, so first off, uh, if you're playing, like, right now, then you can do the Halloween event. Which, let me get to a spot where they have it. Uh, that you can collect werewolf things in Redwoods, which is right here. Uh, where am I? It's over here. Oh, it's so loud. Yeah, so over here you can collect vampire things or werewolf things. And then it'll give, it'll give you a little bit of mushrooms whenever you do. Now, I don't think I have any. Hold on. Yeah, I don't have any. But when you do, you can bring it to this little shrine over here, and then it'll give you some candy for this event. And then you can also buy things in this event. Um, yeah, so you like, complete the werewolf fang ritual 50 times, then you get this creature. Uh, it's not worth so much, so I would just do this so that you can get the candy. Oh, did I see one? Oh, there's two right next to each other. Yeah, there are these little fangs, and it says mysterious fang, it gives you one. And, uh, yeah, you need to collect five, and it won't let you, you know, collect anymore. And it does have an eight-minute cooldown. So, like, you can collect five things, and then it'll take you, uh, eight minutes in order for you to do it again. And so you can do that, or you can do the Pumpkin Smasher. And you don't actually need to do 200 pumpkins. Normally it's 150, but I already did that. Oh. Um, so yeah, you just keep smashing these little pumpkins. So if there's an owl there, those owls are normally bad. Yeah, so you can do this. You just go up to these little clumps of pumpkins with the purple. And then you try to land it in the yellow. And if you don't, then it gets rid of it. And then if you click it in the purple, then it just gives you like one little quarter, not half of it. Now let me show you what I mean. Sorry, they're growling at me. Sorry, guys. So yeah, if you land it in the purple, oh, purple, then it just gives you one quarter. And it does give you two candy most of the time, which isn't a lot. But there's also a chance that it'll give you some other items. Like, let me see if I can try to get it. Whoopsies. Alright, now it doesn't look like I got it. So yeah, you just keep smashing these until you can get... Uh, a lot of like the items that it gives you i'm trying to find it. i don't think i have any right now but yeah, it'll give you a token that you can use and then you can use that to like get other creatures and then i'll also show you some some codes that you can do to get rich too now it's not like rich as an end game rich but uh it is good for like beginners So let me just do this. Yeah, it's not giving me the token, but when it does give you the token, it'll let you get like color palettes. And um, I don't know. I don't think it can give you creatures. I haven't seen any lists of like the percentages of what it can get you. But yeah, so you can do that. And then also you can try to work up to the death token, which let me just get this. Yeah, so let me just go die real quick. 
Let's see, this thing can kill me. Hey, you. Kill me. Kill me, kill me, kill me, kill me. Kill me faster! No, kill me. Hey, you. Do your tail whip. Do the tail whip. Kill me. Kill me. Kill me. Kill me. I think you should be able to hit me from there. Well, he's not going to kill me. I'm just going to kill myself. I'm going to do this. I'm going to run out of stamina. I'm going to drown. And then I'll show you what I mean. So, ooh, what is this? Yeah, so I should start running out of oxygen and stamina. Why isn't this working? Ugh, what is that? That should be able to kill me, right? You're drowning. Get to the surface. Oh, yes, I'm drowning. Kill me. Oh, now I'm burning. Yes, 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 yes. So, like, the more missions in these that you do, uh, the more points you get to the death token. And you can sell that for, like, 10,000 mushrooms. So, yeah, like, 50 points, you get this token. Uh, 100 points, you get the appearance change token, which is, like, when your character has already been alive, you can change what it looks like. And then every 5,000 studs that you travel, you get one point. Which, that'll mean that you need to travel, like, 6 million studs to get that. And then biomes visited. Every biome... Every... <laughs> biome. A uh, biome gives you 3 points. And then growth stages, that's kind of random, but, you know. And then time played, you're gonna need to play a lot of time. Because every 4 minutes, it gives you 1. And then... Uh, also... Every... Uh mission that you do gives you three points so yeah and then you also have the candy here oh that's not the shop here it is and then you can use this candy to exchange it for like creatures uh robux plushie other plushies some different color palettes and a material which like changes what your character looks like without you having to do it and then yeah, so this one, it gives you a random stored creature, which is like it doesn't give you the, um, the species. Like, you can't create an infinite amount anymore. It just gives you, like, one. And then, yeah, let me show you the codes. So, I'm gonna show you some expired ones. It's like the YouTuber ones. It's a YouTuber... I already redeemed code, but it's also expired. And then... I don't know if this one was one. Yeah. There's, like, YouTubers that you can do. And you can also do... Grow big... To get max growth tokens. Reverse... Death gives you... A... A revive token. And you can also have multiple accounts and do it, like, where you just, you know, do all these codes at once. But, you know, on, like, five different accounts, and then you can get rich by doing that. So, yeah. And then, uh, yeah, that's why I have so many mushrooms. You can also buy mushrooms, but I wouldn't suggest that because, what is that, like, $50? I would not do that. Well, U.S. dollars. And then there's also these creatures that you can buy, these creatures. But you can also just trade for them, and I would rather do that. Yeah, but that is how to get rich in Creatures of Scenario. Remember, this game is in Roblox. Um, If we get, I don't know, like 10 likes on this video, I'll do a giveaway for, I don't know, maybe some like creatures, uh, some mushrooms. Uh, tokens, plushies, creatures. I already said that, didn't I? Yeah. But if you want to see the giveaway, I'll do that. Uh, maybe my next video. I don't know. 
But yeah. Um, so I'll talk about that more in the next video. So yeah, that is how you can get rich inside of Creatures of Scenaria in Roblox. So that you're not stuck with the Breek Wick, even though it's like really fast. You can get more things like, uh, I don't have any rich creatures. I just do big ones. Like you can get big ones like this. And then like the high ghosts. Even though they're all kind of cheap. But they're big, so I'm just using this for example. Yeah. So, uh, hold on. I gotta, I gotta do something real quick. I gotta spawn in first. Yeah, I don't have this creature anymore. I just have the stored version. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching today's, uh, yeah, um, how to get rich video in Creature Sub Scenario. So yeah, make sure to subscribe if you want to see more of this. And yeah, so make sure to smash the subscribe buttons and share this video. Now, oh, there's something over there. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.